My name is Bridget Mayo and I live in Richmond, Virginia and I'm a giant nerd. I'm obsessed with Harry Potter and the Hunger Games and Doctor Who and Buffy the Vampire Slayer and Bones and the show, not Bones. But anyway, I'm a giant nerd and I've decided that this year I'm going to try to post a video every single day. So that's what I'm doing now. Um, and today I thought I would tell you about my most embarrassing moments. A couple of them because I have kind of a billion. But here we go. So when I was in kindergarten, my sister was in preschool. And I had never gone to her preschool because I went straight from daycare to school. And so I didn't know anyone there. And she brought me in for show and tell. And I was like her show and tell thing instead of a toy as a person. And everyone got up for their show and tell thing. And they would go on and on about their thing. Like one girl brought cotton candy and was like, my cotton candy is pink and it's fluffy and it tastes good and I got it at the blah 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 and so Debbie gets up there and was like this is my sister Bridget and then she had nothing else to say at all so she was just kind of like uh what do I do and so then the next thing she says to me is turn around so I did and she, I was like I don't know why I'm doing just getting a full circle so everyone can see. Yes, I am three-dimensional. I wasn't really sure. And I was five years old, so I wasn't really questioning. And uh, she turned me around. She pulled down my pants and my underpants. And she goes, uh, And this is my sister Bridget's butt. And so in front of a bunch of little kids and teachers, my butt was in public. My mom's always like, oh, well, no one remembers, but I remember, and it was awful. <laughs> um, now I can laugh at it, but, oh. <laughs> and so, when I got to first grade, this guy, Caleb, came to school, and he was in first grade, too. And I was really close friends with him, and he left school, and we were still friends, whatever. And I had a crush on him. And one time, my mom took us to like her friend's uh, Easter party and there was like an Easter egg hunt for the kids and after that was over then we were playing hide and seek and so while we were playing hide and seek I was crouched down in my hiding space and it was really good I don't remember what it was I was like in a corner behind something underneath something you, you couldn't see me at all and I was so like yeah I got this I got this and I was like but actually I gotta pee I gotta pee really bad Oh my gosh, my bladder's gonna explode, I have to pee. And so, I got up and I ran to the bathroom. And because I knew they were gonna check the bathroom, like, are you hiding in the tub? Are you hiding in the bathroom closet? I locked the door, so no one would walk in on me peeing. So I was on the toilet, and they all came knocking, and they are like, boom, 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 you can't lock this door, we're playing hide and seek, that's unfair, you're cheating! And so... I was like, but but guys, I really am peeing. You, you can't come in. Really, please. I'm peeing. And they just popped the lock. And a bunch of people came in. Including my sister. Some boys. And one of those boys was Caleb. And so not only did boys see me with my pants down on the toilet. The kid I was in love with when I was seven also saw me with my pants down on the toilet. That is all that I'm doing today, and I guess I will see you tomorrow. Happy New Year! Woo!